In a time long ago Jesus told a parable that would touch the hearts of many generations to come. As the crowd gathered around him, eagerly awaiting his words, he began to share the story of the Good Samaritan. The tale unfolded in a land, filled with dusty roads and bustling markets, where people from different backgrounds walked side by side. The protagonist of this story was a man who found himself in great need after being attacked by robbers on his journey from Jerusalem to Jericho. As the man lay there, his body weak and his spirit broken, he hoped for someone to come to his aid. Soon, a priest happened to pass by on the same road. This religious leader, dressed in his sacred robes, saw the man lying there but chose to cross to the other side of the road, not wanting to trouble himself sight of suffering. Soon after, a Levite, another person well versed in matters of faith, also came upon the wounded man. Much to the man's dismay, the Levite also avoided the injured traveler and continued on his way. Just when it seemed all hope was lost, a Samaritan came by. Now, it is essential to understand the significance of a Samaritan in this story. Samaritans and Jews had a long history of conflict and hostility. Yet, it was this unlikely Samaritan who stopped to help the wounded man. He saw beyond religious differences and cultural animosity, recognizing the man's humanity and need for assistance. The Samaritan bandaged the man's wounds and gently lifted him onto his own donkey, guiding him to an inn nearby. At the inn, the Samaritan cared for the wounded man throughout the night, ensuring he received the rest and healing he so desperately needed. When morning arrived, the Samaritan had to continue on his own journey, but he did not forget the injured man. He gave the innkeeper two denarii, a generous sum of money, and entrusted the man's care to him. The Samaritan promised to return and pay any additional expenses incurred during the man's stay. Jesus concluded the parable by asking the crowd, Which of these three individuals do you think was in Meber to the man who fell into the hands of robbers? The answer was evident, even to those who had doubted the Samaritan's intentions. It was the one who showed mercy and compassion, the Good Samaritan. Through this powerful story, Jesus taught the crowd and all who would hear his words that we are called to love our neighbors as ourselves, regardless of cultural religious differences. The parable of the Good Samaritan reminds us of the importance of compassion and empathy in our daily lives. It challenges us to look past societal divisions and see the humanity in every individual. Just as the Samaritan reached out to the wounded man with love and kindness, we too are called to be agents of healing and hope in a broken world. May this timeless story inspire us to walk in the footsteps of the Good Samaritan, extending grace and mercy to all whom we encounter on our own journeys.